Hello, Warriors of Light, and welcome to my 46th weekly podcast. Today, I will be going over the new PvP Series 7, new episode called Mr. Fox Clon's Neighborhood, game editions called Patch 7.1, and my thoughts on Final Fantasy XIV so far. Today is November 16th, 2024. So, PvP Series 7 has started and a great opportunity for gamers to obtain rare items. As previously mentioned, I found that using a feature in Duty Finder called Frontline is a great way to power level through the battle series in addition to using another feature in Duty Finder called Casual Match Found under the PvP menu. Duty Finder allows gamers to enroll in different battles, and the feature called Casual Match allows gamers to enroll in 5 versus 5 battles. Duty Finder can be found from the main menu under the option called Duty. Also, like PvP Series 6, gamers should be made aware that after this battle series ends, these ultra-rare items will not be available, and gamers should try to enroll for these battles during peak hours, like weekday afternoons and nights, and the weekends to gain battle points faster. Next, the brand new episode called Mr. Fox Clone's Neighborhood will be released on December 20 and will show homes designed by Final Fantasy XIV gamers all around the globe. Gamers are encouraged to share their housing ideas and learn from fellow enthusiasts as the host named Foxclon discovers and reviews these magnificent homes. Gamers can submit their Final Fantasy XIV homes for review by submitting a post on X with the relevant details and hashtag. Gamers can find more details on the official Final Fantasy XIV website named The Lodestone. Next, Patch 7.1 is already out and includes main scenario quests called Crossroads, a new alliance raid called Echoes of Vanadil Juno, the first walk, a new dungeon called Yuiawawa Field Station, and a new trial called the Minstrel's Ballad, Sphine's Burden. There are also new lessons for the training area called Hall of the Novice. Gamers can find more details on the official Patch 7.1 website. So lastly, my thoughts about Final Fantasy XIV so far. So, as of today, I am still leveling a fighting style modeled from past adventurers called Dark Knight using quests, found in Thavnir called Allied Society Quests, completing battles found in the book named Wondrous Tales, destroying monsters called Hunt Marks, and participating more in a feature found in Duty Finder called Daily Roulette. So, next week, I want to complete leveling two fighting styles called Dark Knight and Sage. Also, Patch 7.1 is out, and I had a chance to see a lot of the new additions. I won't spoil it for listeners, but this patch has a lot of new changes that haven't been seen before, and I highly recommend new and current gamers check out the new features. So, that's all I have for my 46th weekly podcast. If you enjoy my podcasts, you can subscribe to my English podcast channels on YouTube and Rumble, and my Russian channels on RuTube and VContact. Also, you can follow me on X, formerly known as Twitter, under Dynamist Rhine. I try to answer comments and questions found on my channels through my weekly podcasts. Feel free to post on my social media platforms and subscribe. Thank you for watching. See you next time.